having doubts while study don't worry hey there this is vaishno and welcome back to our youtube channel study to learn in the previous session we discussed about text field class and today we are going to learn about text area so let's start so guys as we seen in the previous session text area is a subclass of text component text area is a multi line text box which is not supported by text field text area is a subclass of text component this provide a pra- paragraph or multiple line as a input now let's see the constructors of text area so first constructor is a default constructor second with one string parameter third with two integer parameters fourth is a combination of second and third constructors and last constructor is with four parameters we will see each constructor in detail so our first constructor will create a empty text area and can be used like this second constructor with one string parameter will create a text area with initial string which is passed in parameter and can be used like this third constructor is with two integer parameters used to set the width of text area as specified in parameters here height is a number of lines or rows and width is a number of characters in each line and can be used like this here 5 is a height at and 50 is a width of text area next constructor is with three parameters which will create a text area with string which is passed in parameter sets the height and width of text area as specified in parameter and can be used like this last constructor is with four parameters first parameter is initial string in text area second parameter specifies the lines in text area third parameter specifies the characters in each line last parameter specifies the type of scroll bar so here are four types of scroll bars which are scroll bar both scroll bar none scroll bar vertical only and last is scroll bar horizontal only after constructors let's see the methods of text area so first method is append with one string parameter used to append a text to the text area and can be used like this second method is insert with two parameters string and integer which are used to insert a text to the te- specific index in the text area and can be used like this third method is a replace range with three parameters which are used to replace a ray string in a text area from a given starting index to the given ending index and can be used like this we can use all methods of text field except echo char methods you can learn this method just by clicking on i button this is a demonstrative program of text area so let's see the program this is import lines in which awt is used for text area class and uh, applet is used for applet class this is init method of applet here we create text area and object is t here we create text area with initial string text area demo here we create three text area with two integer parameters 10 is a height and 6 is a width of text area and fourth text area is with one initial string and height and width of text area respectively here we append string to the text area 4 and here we add all components to the applet now let's see the output of program i wrote this code in dr java you can use any java id as your convenience so let's compile the code and uh, our compilation is completed without any error now re- run the code and our output is here with four text areas at the end of the session we will see some mcqs on today's topic so our first question is the text area control create a what respectively so answer is multi line text next question is which of these methods can be called as on text area so answer is all of the above because all are the methods of text area next question is you want to construct a text area that is 80 character width and 10 character height tall so what code will you use so answer is new text area with two integer parameter first is 10 and second is 80 next question is which method is used to append a string in text area so answer is append with one string parameter next question is which method is used to insert a string at specific location so answer is insert with two parameters one is string and second is integer parameter next question is which of these is not a constructor of text area so all of these are the constructors of text area so answer is none of the above